Hey everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, just quickly before we crack into the next video, I wanted to show you the drive result from uh, video number one, which was the hairdryer versus mouth, where I ended up completely scrapping the hairdryer result and doing two pieces with my mouth and a straw. So I think they dried up really nice. Obviously, with uh, some resin on and um, or a finish on the top, they will really pop. Um, I probably will just clean up some of the edges a little bit where they uh, got a bit mucky or they needed some, some white adding to the corners or the edges, but I think they came out really well. I'm super happy with them. So today what I'm going to do is I'm going to come out of my comfort zone a little bit by doing a canvas with a Prussian blue base um, and some colours on the top of that to see if they pop and they come through. Um, and also I'm going to be working on my consistency, whereas I thought with these my paints were just a little bit too thin. Um, which is pro possibly comes and shows where they've they haven't cracked hardly at all But where they have cracked I think that might have been due to my paints being a bit thin so I'm going to work on my consistency of the paint today um, and Just see if we can work on getting a better blowout Really so yeah, let me uh, rejig everything um, and I'll come back to you when I am pouring the what is going to be the Prussian blue base for me, which is um, unheard of. So I'm really looking forward to it. Anyway, I kind of <clears throat> really happy with my consistency. Um, it's not too thin, whereas, you know, workable. Um, equally, it's not too thick where I can see 
too much. Uh, where I can see too much paint gathering on my canvas. So I see a lot of air. Right, so how do I feel what we've got going on here? I really like up here. It then comes down, round, and starts to swoop back up again. Um, I like the colours, I think they work well together. I might just see how this one dries, I mean I'm not... I think I lost my composition a little bit. Maybe just too much, maybe just too much paint on a smaller canvas. Maybe I was going for a little bit too much with not enough room to work. These 10 by 10 inch canvases, I should probably maybe stick to um, smaller amounts, smaller amounts of paint. Once again, if you do like these videos, please hit the like button and subscribe. Um, it gives me motivation to keep making these. I probably will maybe steer back to my white base with uh, different colors going on the top only for the time being anyway because I'm learning I'm new to this um, and I want to I want to get good at one solid creation which is I think my white base before I then venture out into I don't know the Prussian blues the different pores um, I just want to get this Dutch pour down with a white base and some colors and and produce canvases that I'm really happy with anyway Hey everyone, I thought I'd bring you back. Um, I wasn't happy with what I had. I wasn't going to let it dry. So I've just been blowing at it and I've been blowing at it and blowing to like everything's just merged. However, I think with everything merging, I've ended up with this real cool sort of galaxy-esque vibe going on. With the Prussian blue, the turquoise, some of the magenta... Even the gold, the whites. Um, I, I'm really, I'm really preferring what's happened here versus what I had a minute, um, a minute ago. Mm -hmm.